Yo, what's up YouTube? So it's the big fight this weekend in Vegas. My boy Amir Khan takes on Devin Alexander. It's not good though, because I can't make it to Vegas. You know, I do attend most of Amir's fights, but I won't be there this time around. It's a shame, isn't it? And a lot of my boys are attending the fight. Uh, including Ziggy, though the half a bona fide is going to be there. So shout out to everyone that's going to be there. Have a good time out there, lads. Okay, back to the fight itself. I think it's going to be a massive fight. I think it's potentially going to be one of the biggest fights of the year. You know, simply because there's so much at stake for both of the fighters. You know, both of them can't afford to lose this fight. Because whoever loses this fight, I think their career is going to be in tatters. I think their career is going to go down the route of um, someone like Ortiz. You know what I mean? They won't get like the big fights for at least another 12 months or so, you know. Uh, whereas on the other hand, whoever wins the fight has got every chance of getting that big lucrative bout with uh, Floyd Mayweather. You know what I'm saying? So big things for whoever wins the fight and whoever loses, the career is kind of like, you know what I mean, in tatters. So there's plenty at stake. Now, if you look at Amir Khan and if you look at Devin Alexander, first of all, both of them are similar age. You know, one's 27 and one just turned 28 yesterday, you know. Uh, so both of them are young and, you know, both of them have got the hunger. Um, you know, the style-wise, I think both of them have got the speed. You know, we all know about Amir's uh, super speed, you know what I mean? His ridiculous speed, he's, you know, he's super fast. But Alexander's fast as well, uh, you know. And if, and if you look at the records, um, you know, Alexander's only ever lost twice. You know, he's not a pushover. Uh, and his two defeats came against, you know, against the big names. You know, he lost against Bradley and he lost against Porter. You know, uh, and Amir on paper has lost three times, but in my opinion, he, you know, he's only lost twice because I don't think the Lamont Peterson fight should count because Peterson was on steroids. You know, um, so yeah, it's going to be an interesting fight to watch. You know, because I think it's going to be like a game of chess. It's going to be all about speed and movement. Yeah, uh, but um, I don't think there's going to be a knockout in the fight. I think it's going to go twelve rounds. And I think Ami is going to win on uh, on points. It's going to be a unanimous points decision, you know. And I think Ami is going to win because uh, I think Ami is, you know, I think ultimately Ami's speed and Ami's uh, punching power, especially his body shots, is going to are going to be too much for Alexander, um, you know. And um, you know, I, I can't see Alexander hurting Ami. You know, Kalazzo couldn't hurt Ami, and and is, is much more of a bigger puncher than Alexander, you know. And if he couldn't hurt Ami, I really can't see Alexander hurting him. You know, so yeah, unanimous points decision. I mean, he's going to win the fight and then he deserves to get that big fight against uh, Mayweather. And that is going to be a big fight. You know, it's, that's going to be one of the biggest fights of all time. And we are looking forward to that one. And, and I'm definitely going to Vegas for that if it happens in Vegas. But it's that much of a big fight. I think it's probably going to happen in Rochdale.